In previous episodes, the scum frog fired his manager and became a free agent. He also had his photo taken. It is now clear to the world that he is a seriously cool DJ. Still, he lives in poverty in the desert with holes in his roof. Yo, dude. I just had this amazing opportunity for us to get rich. You'll never believe this. My boy is selling a 200,000 person email list. All of unused AOL accounts? Nah, man. This is targeted subscribers only. I promise. Subscribers to what? Well, I'm not exactly sure, but I think the guy had a non-profit to save the pigeons. He thought that all the cell phone radiation in the air was going to make them become extinct. I think that's bees, but that doesn't matter. Anyway, we'll have a list of 200,000 email addresses of pigeon huggers. Well, change your name to Scum Dove. That's gay. And Scum Frog isn't? Wait, I got it, I know. We have all this wood out in the back. We'll send Pedro back there, he'll make us a gigantic pigeon head, and then you can rock that to all your gigs. I heard that'll make you a lot of money. And we'll use a special code, like instead of S-C-U-M, instead of the letter S, we'll use the number five. So people who don't know the code will say, five cum dove. And people who know what's up will say like, no, 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 it's scum dove. And then everyone will be cool. Yeah, like us. Shortly after the scene was shot, the key grip told the two men about the giant mouse head. Still, the scum frog needs money to fix the holes in his roof.